Are you ready for warm weather and a little sunshine? The Appalachian Wireless team has decided to have the ultimate spring break event. The spring break event is going on now through the end of April, and all smartphones are on sale with Appalachian Advantage. We are you. We are Appalachian Wireless. What began as a traffic stop for a seatbelt violation ended up sending a Floyd County man to jail for auto theft and drug charges. Pikeville police spotted 35-year-old Michael Joe Davis of Betsy Lane driving along US-23 near Shelbyana Food City just before 8 Thursday morning. Davis was reportedly not wearing a seatbelt and was driving 40 miles an hour. After pulling him over, police had determined that Davis had an outstanding warrant and that the Hyundai Tucson he was driving had been reported stolen from Walmart the night before. Not only that, but the condition of the vehicle left officers stunned. Yeah, I've, I've, I've recovered several stolen cars over the years. We, we, we've recovered a bunch of them. I, have, I don't think I've ever seen a car in this kind of shape without being in a collision. Khan said the radio and control center had been removed from the dash and there was other damage inside the vehicle. But things got worse once they started it. And the vehicle was really loud. The sound of the vehicle was really loud when they started it and put it on the, put it on the uh, rollback. And so we raised the hood of the vehicle. Wires had been cut on the vehicle. And the floorboard, the floor pan had been cut out of the vehicle. And the catalytic converter had been stolen off the vehicle also. I have never seen anyone cut the pan, floor pan out of the vehicle to get the catalytic converter out of it. But this one vehicle was, was done that way. So. Police also found about 16 grams of meth in the vehicle. Davis was arrested and charged with auto theft, meth possession, and several traffic violations.